show up well, before I get started, I'm going to pray on the going to the Balana Studio Apostles, the Elders, I love this true flow, the men that be blessed, the little brother with the light with the doctrine, the brother Bakala Wallow, who is another host of Credit Fighting Hunting to the elect body of your hour. This lesson is going to be centered on um, Second Ezra, the ninth chapter. Where it, where it speaks on um, earthquakes and uproars of the people centering around the uproars of the people, which this um, video here shows, you know, because this act of these acts of protest been having a heavy presence in throughout the whole earth in Babylon, the great AK America. And all over the earth, for that matter, you know, uh, is a heavy, pre heavy presence of protests, which is prophecy. Which I'm gonna go ahead and get that verse before I show this video, right? Um, Second Ezra chapter nine, we'll start at one. It says, "He answered the thing and said, Measure thou the time diligently in itself." And when thou seest the part, the signs pass, which I have told thee before, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. So the Lord is visiting the world, right? These signs, but these signs are these prophecies, right? Verse 3, wherefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes, and uproar to the people in the world, right? So it also there have been um, a lot of act, uh, earthquake activity happening in these past few years that just passed, right? Along with these uproars, all of it has been happening, right? Then thou shalt well, verse 4, then thou shalt well understand that the Most High speak of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning, for like as all that is made in the world have a beginning and an end, the end is manifest. So that's what it is. The end is manifest, right? Meaning it's showing itself. So you see these earthquakes and uproars of the people, which is part of the prophecies. Verse 6, even so the times also of the highest have plain beginnings and wonders and powerful works and the endings and effect and effects and signs, right? The endings and effect and signs. So in these endings time in these end times you can see the effects and signs of it. Which are uh, what's what's this this um this lesson is centered on the uproars of the people, right? So I'm going to go ahead and play this video. And I'm going to, you know, breeze through this. Um, this song, I got a, um, a section saved of, um, Protests, cause that's basically what um, uproars are, right? So it says, um, why protesting farmers have French government in a bond? So I'm gonna just play this video. So if you're thinking of taking a road trip through France, this is not the time to do it you're gonna run into tractors, lots and lots of tractors. They're being driven by protesting farmers. They've been out now on the roads for the last couple of weeks, setting up barricades, using hay bales to block traffic, and now using their tractors to essentially encircle Paris with a protest movement of barricades trying to put the government under pressure. 
They have an array of demands, but essentially the message is that in this country that is the European Union's agricultural superpower, being a farmer is becoming increasingly difficult. Farmers say that they're struggling to, with higher costs, that the produce they make isn't getting the money that it used to, and that they're dealing with imports of all sorts of things from chickens to tomatoes, and also produce coming from grain. <laughs> Now, where this goes next isn't very clear. Both sides essentially have settled into a battle of wills with the government releasing some measures, but those measures, the farmers say, aren't going far enough. And so, for the moment, the tractor blockades are in place around Paris and uh, the farmers are setting in for a long haul. Lock your phone, bear with me for a moment. So, um, yeah, see, this they're protesting, right? The farmers are protesting Ooh. in France, right? Due to the conditions of um, you know, their um. Livelihood, basically, right? So that's just one example. So I have this um section here that I see, basically showing says protest, right? So you just seen the first one why protesting farmers have French government in a bond, right? Another one says surge in illegal Chinese immigrants in the U.S., right? Which, you know, people are in the uproar over this. You know, that's why 25 states are divided. 25 are supporting the border, um, um, securing the borders in 25 other states. But I guess they are not concerned with it, right? It says he, the other, this video is is UN funding migrant surge with US tax dollars, right? It was the you know, that I don't know that shouldn't be there, but put it in there anyway. So it says this one here says MAGA has mass off moment when asked about I'm not sure what this is, but people are on in this one, this video on People have been asked about the, who they support, Trump, you know, and all that. So it's basically the people are in the uproar somewhat, you know. This one says, Democratic Socialist of America faces several figures, you know. So, you know, I'm just going through it, you know. German protests throughout nation against the Valentine's Day sale. I got this large capacity to just get the title. What it says German protests throughout nation against far right extremists. Okay. Let's get this title. Thousands of people have gathered Says thousands, thousands gather in Germany to protest against radical right. So there's been a lot of protests, right? Let me see. <laughs> to participate in the mass march for Gaza is this the house of Satan is divided the synagogue of Satan even they are divided right? Satan is divided right? Joseph Robinette Biden 
says hundreds of thousands marched to White White House for Gaza. For both lawmakers and law enforcement, he now wants to go after the protesters in a class action lawsuit. WSP discusses tackling dangerous highway protests in Seattle. They killed him, they tortured him to death. This one says protests turn violent and workers on strike. Could Bangladesh be the next Sir, Sir Lanka? Sri mm -hmm. Lanka. So this is uproars in the world, right? It's in Bangladesh. Mm -hmm. So I've seen a lot of information and misinformation flying around about one of our products, which is Zin Nicotine. So this is as protesters hurl stones at Belgrade City Hall to protest election. So where is this at? YouTube Premium is ad-free YouTube and YouTube Music Premium, a whole app just for... So this one says protesters shut down west, west, um, westbound lanes of Bay, of Bay Bridge. This is California. <laughs> well, at the Asia Pacific Economic... Said protests... Protests erupt around San Francisco. Right? So a lot of the protests is all over the earth. You know, a lot in Babylon, a great a lot all over the earth. Basically, you know. It's by far the UK's biggest demonstration since this. This one says hundreds of thousands rally in London, demanding Gaza ceasefire. Right. There are going to be over 500 actions today around the country. Says no more business as usual. 300 plus cities shut it down for Palestine in global day of action. In global day of action. So it's a global thing. 300 plus cities shut it down for Palestine in global day of action. So these are up rows of the people. You know, this is just some of the many videos that I have. You know, I'm not going to go through all of them. But these are, you know, 90% of these are protests, you know. Probably some other videos that I, you know, probably saved. But 90% of these videos are based upon protest protesters. to the point then bring it out bring it out again it's like as this chapter nine and three it says therefore when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world 
then shall thou well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the beginning. Spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. For like as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, the end is manifest. So that means in the end is showing itself. And just to be clear, you know, to get a definition of hope for, you know, I just want to bring it out in the blue letter, right? Get an example of what uproar means. We can go to the book of Acts, chapter 20, right? Just to see where it says this is Acts 21. It says, And after the uproar was ceased, Paul called unto him the disciples and embraced them and departed from and departed for to go into Macedonia. So there was an uproar, right? So I want to show you. Just to get the definition of what uproar is, right? Just to show it. So, right, quick. Strong's G 2351. Tharubas. Tharubas. This is a noise, sumo, uproar. A person's dwelling. A clamorous. An exciting multitude, a riotous persons, a tumult, a breach of public order, right? So it says over here, strong definition, right? So they, it says a disturbance, tumult, uproar. So we just going to get the definition of uproar, right? Says uproar. This is the first definition: a loud and Im impassioned noise or disturbance. Right. Second definition. This is the point. Right. Is a public expression of protest or outrage. Right. So it's a protest. Same thing. Uproar is a protest. Those clips will be seen. Right. So uproar is protest. We just went through. Uh, s several different clips of uh, protesting throughout the whole earth, which is prophecy. You know, prophecy, a lot of prophecy is happening. You know, all these prophecies that the Lord is speaking about is basically happening simultaneously, right? These plagues, right? Nation rising against nation, war, rumors of war, right? Uh, pestilences, you know? All these um, prophecies, even the Lord Himself, Yahweh, Yahweh Shasalaki, and the Hamashiach, right? The Messiah, Yahweh Shah Hamashiach, spoke Himself, said these things are going to occur, right? The um, troubles, Mark the 13th chapter, which is a disturbance, which falls into um, uproar. Right, just like it says here, disturbance. If you go into that word trouble in Mark the 13th chapter, it's basically it says the disturbance, right? Just go there real quick, Mark 13. Mark 13 and 7, right? It says, And when ye shall like it, and when ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, be ye not troubled, for such things must need be, but the end shall not be yet. For nation shall rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be earthquakes in diverse places, right? Earthquakes just like second Ezra the ninth chapter. Earthquakes in diverse places. There shall be famines, right? Troubles. These are the beginning of sorrows. See, there's famines also. Pestilences, right? Troubles. 
we went to the world of trouble, right? You got earthquakes there again. Earthquakes, we going to the world of troubles. Disturbance, right? It's like we seen it in, in um, Acts, the book of Acts. I think it was the 20th chapter. Go on this word disturbance. Same thing as uproar, right? It said the interruption of a settled and peaceful condition. Right? Second definition, a breaking down of peaceful and law abiding behavior. A riot. See? A riot. Uproar. Right? A loud and impassioned noise. See? A disturbance. Uproar. So all these things are happening. Prophecy, just like it says in yeah, uh, Second Ezra the ninth chapter, earthquakes and uproars, troubles. Basic is it basically troubles means uproars has had you know these these troubles, including uproars. People are in an uproar, protesting about what's going on in the world, right? So that's troubles. Also falls in the category of troubles, these um uproars, protests. So I'm gonna go ahead and end it off that, right? So these are all prophecy, right? Prophecies happening, famines, pestilences, earthquakes in diverse places, wars and rumors of wars, um, uproars, right? Nation rising against nation, kingdom against kingdom. Right? All these things are happening simultaneously throughout the earth. Showing the um signs of the end, right? So I'm gonna go on in and off that. I hope it's edifying to the elect. I don't wanna say call for like I'm like Yahweh, Bashu, Yahweh Shah Bashu, Makakadash, Shalom to the next time Yahweh represent, which means Lord willing, and why Abba the ball. ETA soon.